All right, now let me show you a scenario where you need to as built this pipe down here. You can see this pipe down here at the bottom is an open end pipe. Let's say you have an unsafe situation there where you can't get down in there. You don't have tilt compensating, but they want flow line. They don't want just the top of the pipe, as you can see down there. If you know what the size of the pipe is, which I know that these are 18 inch pipes, if they want you to as built it, but not want you to as built the flow, or excuse me, just the top, they want flow line, go into your roller stuck in the mud, go to point and call this uh, flow line, we'll put FL 18 inch pipe. And then what you could do here for uh, offset is put in 18 inches. So what do we got? 1.50, 1.50. But we want to make that an off, off minus. You don't want to go ab above. So minus 1.50. We'll leave that to that. And then we'll take this off. We'll set down here on the top of the pipe. We'll go ahead and take the shot. Boom. Same thing over here. We're just going to set down on the top of the pipe. Keeps us nice and safe. It's an 18 inch also. We'll come over here and we'll set down on the top of this pipe and we'll shoot it right there. Boom. So that those points actually will be offset to a flow line because it's 18 inches. For example, if I touch and hold on that one that I just did, we're going to stake that point. We'll go back over to it and we'll set down on the top of it. You can see I got to cut a 160, 150 right there, which means that's telling me that I got to go 150 down to get to flow line. So that's another option right there. The next option here is you can see right here, we've got a whole bunch of utilities that have been vac trucked. So right here, we got a bunch of utilities way down in there, kind of hard to see it was, they were vac trucked. Yes, you can go ahead and just shoot your pole down in there and set it down on there. But if you had a situation where your pole wouldn't fit, but you know what the offset is from up top, go ahead and do the typical take a tape measure. And from the very top here, I got about four feet. So all I got to do for my vertical offset here, go into my roller stuck in the mud. We'll call this, uh, that down there is a utility. For point code, I'm going to make sure that I put this on fiber. And then for my offset, I'm going to put in minus four feet. Then I don't have to shoot my rover down and put my rover down in the hole if I have an unsafe situation. We'll go ahead and hit accept. We'll hit go and go. So there's another opportunity to do a vertical offset. Because if I now stake that same point, go back and stake it and I set back on where I was at I've got to cut a four foot right there so multiple different ways that you can use vertical offset